A new study published by CU Boulder reveals air pollutants in the Elyria Swansea neighborhood are coming from multiple sources. Denver 7's Veronica Costa spoke with the researcher about what they learned and a local organization that has continuously asked for more accountability. On a Wednesday afternoon, all is quiet in the Elyria Swansea neighborhood. The homes in the neighborhood are still, but just behind them, the oil refinery is not. We found that at any given time, at any given second, the community is breathing in not just one contaminant, but a mixture of contaminants that are impacting health. Air quality issues are a battle Cultivando, a nonprofit that's worked on environmental justice in the neighborhood, has fought for for years. And now a study published by CU Boulder researchers backs up what they've known for a long time. We learned a couple different things. The first being there's a high concentration of VOCs or volatile organic compounds like benzene coming from places like Suncor. The second, there are other places emitting these kind of pollutants too, places like a small wood shop in the neighborhood. This doesn't necessarily mean that the wood shop is emitting a ton of VOCs and it's going to impact Denver, but we previously haven't been able to really identify and see what we call hyper local sources like this before. That's a notable point to make because while researchers found the wood shop is emitting at least one kind of pollutant, it's not on the same scale as Suncor. It was pretty surprising. The data was gathered with this piece of equipment. Researchers placed it in the back of a vehicle and then drove through the neighborhood, noting when it picked up pollutants. Its work, Cultivando says they hope continues across the board. I think this study is very validating. Um, validating to and supportive of the findings that we uh, described in our study. Higher rates of VOCs, VOCs having health impacts in the community, and VOCs coming from Suncor and other contaminators or other polluters. In Commerce City, Veronica goes to Denver 7. We reached out to Suncor for comment, but they have not yet responded.